So we got Chet Holmgren against Jabari Smith Jr., man. Before we get to it, make sure you like, comment, share, and if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, join the team. Now look, everybody, the tweets I seen, I seen like little title that were talking about Chet, <laughs> Chet equals GOAT. So we finna see if this man was actually hoping or not. And Jabari Smith is nice too. So we finna, we seen Jabari Smith play Paulo, and I'd say Paulo won that battle. Even though it's still Summer League, I think Paulo won that <laughs> that battle. We're going to see him play the GOAT right now. Just a few Chet minutes last year before he went down with a sprained ankle. Had a real good rookie season. He but this sends is, it over to Aaron Wiggins. This is the, the full game highlight. Let me let me throw that in there, too. Two berries of three. Jamar Smith's got to be ready to shoot those. Here's the feed to Holmgren. Knicks initially had position. Nice foul by Smith to take it away. Down floor, alley -oop. crab and flush. He's got to see plays, but he is a dynamic, physical, hard driver that has all different ways to finish. He's in good look at a three and knocks it down from guard. I mean, he's a seven foot one guy that has a oh, guard yeah, set skill. Yeah, Chet. Holmgren spinning down the lane against Knicks. And you have to look past the body. He's just a, a thin body. You wonder how much weight he's going to be able to put on his look career. Look how skinny he is. Overcomes it all as Wiggins. Like, I know KD came sure. in the league and he was skinny. The they said he couldn't bench the bar or whatever. Long rebound. Houston will get another. This looks. Knicks from the wing knocks it down. Get to his legs. If he's going to play straight up the down, like he up could underneath them. And get to his legs, but I don't know, man. I don't even know what to say. He's so skinny, I'm lost for words. Like, this is from outside. Oh, uh, like imagine. Hold up, I'm sorry. Imagine this man, Chet Holmgren, when he gets to the league. He's gonna have. Ooh, hold up. I gotta look at this. I gotta watch this whole play before I get my thoughts. That man, Josh Giddy in this bag. Oh, spin move. Spin move. Ooh, this time one. Like imagine Chet play. having to go against, cause he's gonna get a lot of minutes in OKC cause they're garbage. OKC is trash right now. They got potential. They got a whole bunch of good pick. Like Chet might be good. Josh Giddy looks solid. Shea Gilgis is good. Like they have potential to be like good in the future. But listen to this. This man Chet is gonna have to guard Giannis. Like imagine what Giannis is gonna do to him. He get hit one time in his body. He's, they're gonna send him to the fifth row, and then a Zion, like Zion, come back healthy. Zion was bullying Giannis. If Zion hit this man Chet Holmgren in the chest, he's gonna disintegrate. Like he's just gonna melt. Like he, he'll, he'll just break in half, man. Like nah, man. Three pointer is up and missed. If he get matched up with Zion, Eric Holman, another offensive rebound. It's Holman who's got some momentum and he flushes on his head. See, they were saying he got dunked on, which he did get dunked on. Don't get me wrong, he got banged Eric on. Holman, but it's not. Off. See, it's not as bad if you're trailing. If you're trailing like this, it don't look as bad. Now, if he was down here and he came and he came from up here and dunked on, him, it's Holman, that would be really bad. And he flushes over. But as a shot blocker, you're gonna get dunked on. What's called average? Like I don't want to say average is four. City ended but he got four this game. He had six worst first. record. He's averaging like West, three blocks a but game. But a lot of guys got some really valuable time as Lind Eason for three. Hudgens, the lefty. I wonder how many down. of these people actually get picked up, like from. Do you watch Robinson? So you know you have the his ability to communicate defensively. It's really and then you have some people that are actually the on the league. Team. I wonder if any new NBA people action. do they Working here pick up the team? How many of them actually get signed? Ooh. Oh, beautiful no look as Eason puts you in nice. front. Trevor Hudgens, part of that, saying if you can play, we'll find you. A guy who played at Division Two was just a winner, flat out winner. There are guys that emerge and Jabari, who were drafted. I didn't know you could suit like Spell their first names differently. And they did that Spider Man meme where the two Ooh. Spider Men are looking at each other of the four games here at Thomas and Mac. Now, I didn't know. I guess they could suit. On I didn't realize he was 40 New Orleans. in college. Tari like 42 percent. The shots and some of the that looks man, that he's had so far in this first half. Just hasn't cashed in. He's got to get by his man. There's a scoring opportunity right there. Offensive rebound. See, the, the thing, I think what's different about Chet, Paulo, and Jabari, 
I don't think Jabari can create his own shot like the other two. I think Chet and Paolo can create their own shot better than Jabari. I think Jabari needs to like get his off of like guards per se, which I don't know. I see on defense, he's great on defense because he has a high motor and all that. But on offense, I don't know if Houston <laughs> would be the right move for him to get his looks. Cause, like, if he went to OKC, if Jabari Smith went to OKC, he'd be, I think he'd be thriving with Josh Giddy and Shea Gilgis. Like, creating open looks for him. But I don't know if Houston with Jalen Green. UNLV. Um, who else? Uh, to work. Kevin Porter, yeah, cause you all know that. Everybody know they're looking to get theirs. Shots. He's rebounded the ball. He's defended. Now he's gonna knock down that jumper. See, he need he need people to set him up. Got away with it. Holmgren had it taken away by Eason. Final seconds of the half. Ooh. Nice sidestep three. Washington knocks it down with a second to go. So I don't know who's gonna be able to create for him so he can get easy loot. Great pass. Christopher from Knicks on a beautiful pa pass. Really good pass, but terrific. Oh, bang time. Bang time. Number two. Y'all better get out of the uh oh. How that well. happened? A beautiful. He just walked to the rim. Josh Giddy. That man walked well, back door. That's <laughs> a terrific cut. He needs body. Number 12, look, Oklahoma uh, City had the two oh, out of yeah. 12. And, and then he fouled. I would have taken Josh him out. Giddy. You got to come out now. <laughs> that whole play was bad. You got to come out. Aaron Wiggins that time. Great recovery. Oh, this man. This man. <laughs> this man's man showing out. That's showing his athleticism. See? I think, I think that's where Chet's going to be, like, offensively, I don't know. And then him against, like, the Zions and the them strong dudes. If he get hit in his chest, he's out for the rest of the game. But for the most part, I think he could either block or make shots. He'll change shots for sure, and a lot of them at that. Oh, like he's already in the lead shot blocker. He's in the lead shot blocker already. He hadn't even been in the lead. Another great cut. Nick finishes it off. Of but I don't know. Like, when he get hit in the chest, I don't know how many more, how many much of them he gonna be able to take. Hasn't made that correction yet. Had a good look right from the he, start. He gonna right mess around. Zion gonna hit him in the chest. He gonna break a rib. Or this man is flying. Nice ball movement. And there it goes down for triple double in three games in the Salt Lake City Summer League. But somebody it, it, mad. It took a while, you know, and I, it, even at our level, it takes a while to, for the even the great players. Oh, to that was nice pull up. Defending, he's rebounding, he's active, building, rebuilding the identity and the culture of the Rockets piece by piece. Obviously, Jabari's a big part. Mm -hmm. Love the game. He, 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 you know, and he's a, he's a really good basketball player. Um, like I said, oh, you if you're watching the interview, we're excited about him. Where are you guys the roster like. right now? I mean, splash. We I even shoot. And these games, I doubt they'll nothing. sign him, but he's he can shoot. NBA Nobody be in the G he's League. He's NBA defensive principles. Uh, he's oh, learned Josh Giddy. Josh Giddy will mess around, punch on you. He punched on someone early. Don't get it. You gonna fall Nick's asleep? You gonna dunk on the third quarter and he buries a three. Oh, a Nineteen rocket turnovers. Jane can't finish. What was that? Yo, this Jane man is hoping. He going Porter crazy. The Thunder have scored eleven of the last. Oh, he going teams. crazy. They the lead and a chance for a little more. Jang, the rookie. Nah, he going crazy. Great deflection. The boys made with three for Four sixteen. And a half go, Washington. Ah, uh, nah, he was getting him up. Look at that. Three for sixteen. Ah, uh, nah. See, I thought he wasn't getting shots up. He was putting them up. That boy was putting them up. Great wasn't hitting none of them. <laughs> Four and a half minutes to go. That boy wasn't hitting none of them. Jack That's why who, Chet the goat, I guess. He's a lot taller than you're realizing. Jabari Smith. Woo, that man was putting up a lot of shots. Three oh, seconds good. to shoot in the position. This man is hoping. Do right here. Blazers That's good. Next. Another oh. one for Chet Holmgren. That's Giddy hooping too. 
Giddy nearly stripped. Recovers. Josh and Giddy hoping to. Play, you know, people talk about seeing okay. plays. Offensively, he sees plays defensively develop. Four blocks for Holmgren all in the second half. Big bucket. Well, he had a fantastic four years. Now, Chet's already at least top block. We've got a good one here so far tonight. Knicks, nice pass. Eason able to finish it off. Dacian Knicks directing the offense. I uh, see. Washington makes a run at Giddy. Oh, oh off balance, able to put it up and into the lead with 27 seconds. Man, hit the to go. on him. Knicks over the top. Christopher makes the catch and puts it in with 10 seconds left. I about to say, why did he three man on this play? Here he comes. And good foul at 8.5 seconds to go. Unless the sack clock was going down. And about a half nearly stolen by man. And Eason is fouled with 4.1 to go. Uh oh, Chad is he Chad Holmgren in the trail spot. Down two. Giddy. Ah, uh, he got a good look, it's too. Over in the Houston Rockets. Ah, uh, he got look. a good look. Uh oh, dodgeball. Dodgeball tournament, July 15th. Well, that's it for the video. Chet. Jabari Smith, Jabari Smith, I, I'm giving it to Chet just because I seen Jabari Smith with three for 16 at one point. I want to see, I don't have, oh yeah, I do. I want to see this man's stats for the game. Like, I, I need to see what he shot. The three for 16, they just threw that in there all sly, like all, all, like all quiet. Like, wasn't nobody going to realize <laughs> what that just said. So Chet Holmgren had 12 points, 8 rebounds, 2 assists, 2 steals, 4 blocks. He was 3 for 10. At least he knew, I don't have it going, let me chill out. So Jabari Smith was 5 for 19, and he finished with the same amount of points. <laughs> they almost had the same stat line, because what's called took 10 less shots. So I'm giving it to Chet, but that's it for the video. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Until next time, I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.